This is one of the last pictures of 29-year-old Rika Okada before she disappeared in late March. On her Facebook page, she said she was going to see an old friend she hadn't seen for at least a decade. Over a month later, her body was found stuffed into this storage locker on the outskirts of Tokyo, more than 400 kilometres away from her home in Osaka. Even more bizarre, her body had apparently been posted here from Osaka in a two-metre-long parcel labelled as containing a doll. The postage had been paid with Miss Okada's own credit card. But the story gets even stranger. This apartment being searched in Tokyo was home to a Japanese-Brazilian woman, an old schoolmate of Miss Okada, and now the chief suspect. After Miss Okada disappeared, a woman fitting the suspect's description went to this Osaka passport office and applied for a new passport in Miss Okada's name. Earlier this month, that woman used the passport to leave Japan and to fly to Shanghai. Once there, she continued to use Miss Okada's credit card, reportedly racking up bills of at least 10,000 US dollars. It is in Shanghai the woman has now apparently turned herself in to police. Rupert Wingfield Hayes, BBC News, in Tokyo.